Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. This is Rocket Ed with more on December tips. In this video, I'm going to break down toxic flame so we understand what works and what doesn't work with this skill rune. This is very confusing. There's a lot of conflicting information about this um, skill rune. So I decided to make in a, a video where I can document everything so we know for a fact uh, the stuff that works and the stuff that doesn't work. And uh, this way we don't have to choose who we're going to believe. Uh, we just will know the fact and that's more important. So let's start uh, reading the description of Toxic Flame. Toxic Flame fires a piercing Toxic Flame that deals poison dots. So this uh, is very important. Let's start with that. Um, the damage done by Toxic Flame is poison dot. What that means is uh, as soon as you hit the target with your uh, Toxic Flame, it already stacks. Look. It's already stacking. This is already the first stack. So one, two, three, four, five. That's the maximum stack. I actually did six there. So um, all damage that you do is poison dot. You don't hit the enemy and there's a chance that you poison the enemy and then the enemy gets poisoned and the, that poisoning creates a damage over time. No. Your damage is not projectile damage. Your damage is dot damage. It's a poison dot. So that's why it says here, it's not affected by projectile damage. That means that we can safely use multi-shot. Multi-shot will increase your projectile count, but it dampens uh, your projectile damage by 15%. So every other skill, when you add multi-shot, you will increase the um, the amount of projectiles that you have, but your damage will be uh, decreased. That doesn't happen with uh, Toxic Flame because Toxic Flame is not affected by projectile damage. It does not do projectile damage, it does poison dot. So, um, now let's understand it purses all. What that means is it's a piercing Toxic Flame. It fires a piercing Toxic Flame that pierces all. It never misses. You can hit all your enemies as long as you want. You will never miss. You always hit your target. Okay? So that is important. And um, that also means you do not have to worry about hit rate. Okay? You don't have to increase your hit rate. So when you are enchanting your gear and you get like a very big hit rate or a spell hit rate, uh, there's no need to be happy because uh, it, it doesn't matter for Toxic Flame. Toxic Flame always hits, okay? Um, now, another thing about uh, doing uh, Poison Dot is that Dot doesn't crit. Your damage will always, the numbers will, they will always be white. Um, you will never see a yellow number popping up because yellow numbers mean crit damage. So you don't get crit damage. You will always hit, but you will never do crit damage. That means you also don't have to worry about critical hit. You don't have to worry about increasing your spell critical rate and your spell critical damage. Just ignore critical uh, hit altogether because that's not part of your build. What else can you talk about? About Toxic Flame. Well, uh, Toxic Flame does not cause poisoning. It does poison dot. Uh, it, does a, it is a poison damage, um, as we can see here. There is a poison tag, it is a poison dot, it is a poison ele uh, element, but it does not poison the enemy, and that can be very, very confusing. Although it does poison damage, it does not cause poison ailment. There is no status affecting the enemy of poisoning. You do not inflict poisoning on the enemy. You just add a poison dot. It, it's just a poison damage, but it does not cause poisoning. It's very confusing, I know, but just try to wrap your mind around it. Um, and we can prove that, okay? Um, let's just get here Deadly Poison. Deadly Poison already specifies that it cannot apply poison, okay? Um, but it gives 5% uh, damage amplification against poisoned enemies. Now, a poisoned enemy is an enemy uh, afflicted by poisoning it has the status effect of poisoning. So only 
if toxic flame could actually poison the enemy, uh, would deadly poison work? And we just added it here and it did not change the DPS. So that already shows us that it, 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 it doesn't work with toxic flame and we can just hit the dummy to check it out. Like I'm, I'm gonna hit it once, 47. And uh, I'm now gonna hit it with the deadly poison. <clears throat> and we have the same 47k. So um, no, it does not work because toxic flame does not cause poisoning. So that's another thing. Now, I saved uh, uh, the most, um, I saved for last the most intriguing one. I posted um, a video about my improved build doing a little over 1 million DPS. My build is already now at uh, 2.1 DPS. Um, and I, <clears throat> I'm a free to play player, except for the fact, well, I'm not a free to play player, I'm a low spender because I bought. Um, I bought room in my storage. I bought storage room, okay? And um, I got the, the, the six links for my toxic flame. So that's it. Uh, I don't buy a lot of stuff. So as you can see here, I don't have a lot of uh, rare uh, link rooms. I just got this one. So I have two rare ones and that's it. Uh, so this is uh, like a budget build doing two million DPS. I'm very satisfied with it. Now, so in, in my last video, which I published uh, a few days ago, uh, someone commented uh, that, look, you, you, you're you using the Frost, which is this one I'm going to show you guys. And I have made a change since then. Um, when you go here, Frost. See here, um, Poison Duration. I was getting all of these. And Poison Duration doesn't work. And he was right. Poison Duration doesn't work. Poison Rate. Uh, damage against poisoned enemies because there's no poisoning in toxic flame. So I was wasting uh, points in these uh, because these did not work. Okay. Now here's something strange. I streamed Sunday and I showed everyone how uh, increasing poison damage didn't work. I have the video proof of that and I showed everyone, look, I'm just going to craft here a weapon. And I'm gonna add poison damage to it and I'm gonna hit the dummy and I hit it and it showed a certain amount of damage and then I removed uh, from the same weapon I removed I disenchanted it and I attacked the dummy again and the same amount of damage so by Sunday uh, plus uh, increasing your poison damage wasn't working so I just advised everyone look remove all the uh, uh, poison damage increases from your uh, zodiac because it's not working when I was doing the video for for uh, today when I was making this video and uh, I was going to show you guys the evidence that it does not work I, I was surprised because now it is working so let's let me show you guys so I don't know why this happened but it is happening so here we have a Oblivion Scepter, it, it, it's a common scepter, it doesn't have anything in it, all right? So you're just gonna make a hit with it, and now we have 38k. Of course, I have damage from the other scepters as well, but if, um, if I add the poison damage here to this scepter, and this damage increases, then that means that poison damage uh, is working, all right? So I'm doing 38.8. 38.8. Now I'm gonna add the poison damage here. Damage, poison damage. I have now 25% poison damage. Do it with poison damage. I'm doing 40k, so it is increasing. Okay, yeah, it, it works. It works now. It was not working uh, Sunday. So this is very um, confusing. I checked the patch notes to see if there was any change in the game, if they changed the, 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 the way the Toxic Flame works. I tried to make a post on Reddit. Um, actually, I read a, a post on Reddit about it and uh, nobody really explained it. Uh, no, actually, nobody said if they noticed any changes. Um, 
So if you guys know anything, know about any changes in Toxic Flame, please tell me. It's always good that you try to, to test it, uh, test things out. I, I just talked to guys from my build, from my guild and they just noticed too. Look, they said, look, I, had a, I have a glove here that, got, that gives plus 55% uh, poison damage and I was disappointed with it because it wasn't working. It wasn't increasing my damage and now all of a sudden it, it is increasing. So... I believe there is probably, uh, because more people are noticing this, uh, there is probably a change in the game um, that is allowing the increase of poison damage uh, affecting Toxic Flame. So that is all that I wanted to show, guys. Uh, I hope now we you can have a better understanding of what works and what doesn't work with Toxic Flame. Uh, it's always important to have um, factual knowledge so you know for sure where you're going to spend uh, your points in the zodiac, how you're going to enchant your weapons, so you, do, you, you don't incur into mistakes, and you don't depend into conflicting information, like who's right, who's wrong. So I try to present uh, as many facts as possible here, uh, so you have um, not just an opinion about Toxic Flame. You can leave this video uh, after 10 minutes, with uh, factual knowledge about how things work. At least I tried my best to do that. If you have any other information to add to this video, uh, please post it on the comments. If you have any observations, if you think that I said anything wrong, you please just correct me in the comment section. I have no problem with that. I like to use the comment section as an extension uh, for the video because in the video I'm the only one talking and in the comment section you guys have the chance to talk as well and we can exchange uh, 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 ideas. Also note that I have a Discord channel now for my uh, uh, for my YouTube channel, I have Discord server and the link for that Discord, uh, Discord server is also in the description of this video so check it out. Um, it's a bilingual, uh, we have a community both in Portuguese and in English and as you, as you can see, I make videos in both languages and uh, I'll be more than happy to welcome everyone, both English speakers and Portuguese speakers um, in my Discord uh, server. Okay, so this is it. See you guys next time. I hope you enjoyed this content. If you did, don't forget to like it uh, and share it with your friends. And if you want to subscribe as well, so you help us grow and uh, that helps YouTube to show our video to more people. All right, this is it. See ya.